we are going to check the following, the sum, as n goes from 1 to infinity. We will look at the absolute value of sine of 2n over n plus 3 to the nth power. Even though sometimes this the sine of 2n, sine of 2, 4, 5, so on, that might be negative. Absolute value, take care of that business, and we can say this is less than or equal to the sum as n goes from 1 to infinity. Now, the top is less than 1, so the whole fraction like this is still, you know, this is still less than that. So we have that. And this becomes the question that we did earlier, but real quick, we can just say this right here is less than or equal to the sum as n goes from 1 to infinity, 1 over 3 to the nth power. Especially if you have to do this question itself, right? You cannot just say look back to question number 17. Anyway, this right here, you write down r is equal to 1 third. Take the absolute value, which is less than 1, which is a convergent. And now you can come back here and can say this right here also converges. And now here's the deal. You took the absolute value and converges. You can say this right here, absolute converges. Up to you though, depends on the question. But you can just say this right here, converges.